Hi, in this video we're going to show you a way you could customize your Windows 11 taskbar. So we just did a video on how to customize your Windows 11 start menu. So there's also a way to customize the taskbar using the same procedure here. So we're going to be using a program called Windhawk. It's uh, free to use. You just download and install it. So it acts as a repository uh, for Windows mods as they call them. So once you install it, you'll have your installed mods and some featured mods. And then you could go to explore and see what's out there and actually do some searches as well. So the one we're going to be using today is called Windows 11 Taskbar Styler. So if you do a search for this in the Explore section, you should be able to find it. Then you just click on Details and then Install. So we already have it installed here. So once you have it installed, you could enable it and disable it. So we click on Enable. You can see it's using the last setting here, which is the Translucent Taskbar. So you can see it's see-through there. And so there's a couple other ones you could do. You could do none, but that'll put you back to the default. Uh, Windows XP. So if you want to go old school like that, you know, the start button still works the same and the start menu will look the same unless you want to use the other mod to customize the start menu. And then we have bubbles. So that'll put everything in kind of rounded bubbles, which is kind of neat too. And then of course, if you change your mind, you want to go back, you could either come back here, change it to none, or just simply click on disable and it'll put everything back. All right, so we just figured we would show you this real quick because it's a really easy way to do some customization of your taskbar without having to do any you know, registry hacks or things like that. So I'll put a link in the description where you could download Windhawk. And then like I said, just do a search for Windows 11 taskbar styler, install it, and then you should be good to go. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.